Hey guys! Today I want to do my Reborn Pacifier collection. So yeah, these are um, ones that I have for the Reborns, even though I do not use pacifiers too often for them. Um, especially my preemie because his head is so small he looks ridiculous. So anyway, I'm just going to go ahead and get started and I'm hoping not to make this too long. So my first two here are Care Bear ones that I got at the Dollar Tree um, a while ago. Um, the reason I picked them up is because the top one is Wish Bear. I don't know if you can see very well. But Wish Bear is my favorite Care Bear, so I had to pick them up. And they're two for a dollar is pretty cheap. So, yep. And then um, this one is for Maybelline. It's a bigger one. It is um, six to 18 months. It's just a nook, but I like the colors. So, I. Yep. Alright. And this one is a ma'am. I haven't modified it yet, but it's a puppy dog. Super cute. Um, this one I got a sample of. I got two of them. I gave one to a friend who just had a baby. And their hospital actually gave her a ma'am like this with the bunny rabbit on it instead of a Suvi. So maybe certain hospitals are going towards these newborn ma'ams now. I don't know. So I gave her my second, my double of that. And then these two are also newborn ma'ams. Um, but I took the nipples off because I was going to try to use them for Caleb. The bottom one's like a leaf and the top one's a bluefish, but they just did not look right, so if I ever get a smaller baby, I'll use those. And I'm just throwing them on the floor right now. And this one is for um, Dixie. It's an event, and events fit the Libby's um, mouth very well because of how flat the pacifier is, and she has big cheeks. So, yeah, that's for her, and I like it. it came with a little case for the nipple. And these two I also got for Dixie, but I've yet to modify them because um, my cuticle cutter is at my mother's house. So, yep, so I got those for her. Okay, and then this one is um, a born free one. It's not really for anybody because none of my babies can take um, a full pacifier. So, yeah, maybe one of these days I'll get one that I can for silicone. But, yep. And this one, oh, these two are also newborn uh, mams, but they still have nipples. This one I had modified for Caleb for a while, but um, I took the magnet off because I didn't like how it looked on him. It says mute button. This one is a Tommy Tippy, I believe. This is another one of those born free ones. And these two are identical Tommy Tippy ones. I got them at um, um, Toys R Us and it was a three pack. So it was like buy two and the third one was attached there for free. Um, this is a, a medium man. These are larger mams that can, um, or Maybelline that can fit her. This one is already modified for Dixie. Event. And then this one is modified for Maybelline. I love the colors on these. It's a nook. Oh, this one I got last um, Christmas on clearance, so I got it for like 25 cents. So I need uh, to not magnetized, but I um, modified that one for Mabel. And this one I did have for Dixie, these uh, memes. Um, but I redid her head, as you guys see in previous videos, so the magnet's not quite where it needs to be. Because I had to take out my name and put a new one in. And this one's just a cute one. That's the nipple. It's just like a, I don't know, a store brand or something. I'm not sure. 
Okay, and this one is another Tommy Tippy that I tried to, um, to modify for Mabel. And this Tommy Tippy. And then this is a Nook one. Um, I think it's a littler Nook, so I'm not sure if it'll fit Mabel, but it's pretty cute. came with a bottle that I had. And this um, squirrel one, he sort of looks like Scaredy Squirrel um, that I, I um, have for Mabel. Then these ones I got for Mabel, and these are my favorites for her. It's a turtle and a giraffe. I, I still have to modify them. I hate modifying pacifiers. <laughs> and then uh, I got these, the Frax um, pacifiers. They were super cheap. They were less than a dollar at Babies R Us because I guess they're... I'm getting rid of them, but I did not realize that they're 18 month plus and what their brand, um, the bigger pacifiers, they're not latex or silicone, they are hard plastic. It started to break the habit of having a pacifier once they get older. So yeah, this one unfortunately will not be useful for any of my reborns, but they're less than a dollar, still cute. I just did not realize that. So there they are. I got the last two packs, and then this pack as well, let me see, there we go. This one's puzzle pieces, looks really cute, and then polka dots, super cute. Then I got um, this one free as well, it is a ma'am pacifier, and it does say ma'am on it, super cute. And these I got on clearance for 49 cents at Dylan's. They're just regular, or Kroger's, I guess you could say. They're just um, regular pacifiers. I saw that they're 6 to 12 months, so they'll probably fit Mabel. I'll have to try them on her sometime. And the last thing is this um, Nook um, pacifier clip that came with the bottle and um, pacifier that I just shown you. So, yeah, so that's good for like props. And they have this on it so you can use it for a ma'am or a nook, pretty much anyone. They, whether they have a circle or a handle type thing. So just do it like that for a circle one. Let's see if I can find one with a handle real quick. Oh here's one. We'll just use it with the nook. Okay one and then ones with the handle. Let's see if I can remember how to do it. So these are different than past bar clips I that um, we had when Avery and them were little. And my hands just don't work well. It's not that hard. <laughs> and then you just sort of tie it around the handle for one that has a handle. So guys, that is my past bar collection for my reborns. <laughs> so I hope you guys enjoyed watching. I like watching other people's collection videos. So. I thought I'd show mine. So, yep, thanks for watching. Bye.